I got this scholarship in 2013. Uh, after finishing my KCP, I got the results uh, 385, and so I decided to take an opportunity. If the scholarships are awarded on merit based on your performance, uh, and the performance is uh, rated differently across the counties to ensure equity. We were given a form to fill, which uh, was basically about the family background. First, I went for an interview where they asked me questions about my background and everything that included, uh, everything that made me uh, need a scholarship. My mom could not afford to, to pay for me the school fees for, for the high school. And uh, uh, since I had qualified for, for scholarship, uh, I, I went for interview. I went to the branch and after going to the branch, I got the letters which I filled the form. Then we went for interview where I passed. They have to have passed their KCPE exams. And for this, we use a county cutoff system where we determine the cutoff based on the performances across the various counties so that we ensure that the performance has been rated equitably. If I had not gotten this scholarship, then I don't think that I will be in a better school that will shape my future. I couldn't be staying at home because my mother is not, we are not came from rich family. I did get the KCB Foundation Scholarship. Maybe I could have gone to the school that is near our home. I think I will have been in a local secondary school where education will not be so effective and efficient. I guess maybe I will have opted to go to a cheaper school and left Pangani or I will have given up on education by now. So you write a line bill to make a difference in others like not mine. Uh, so far we have about 1,000 students who have benefited uh, by being recipients of scholarships. That includes the people currently in the system, includes 80 students with disability who are currently in Form 1 and Form 2, and over 150 alumni who are currently either pursuing employment or have further studies. My mission is KCB, come next year, we recruit more persons living with disability, the students, so that we can support them because if we don't support them, their life may be difficult. When I look at our society and see how people are needy, so you, you feel like it's a burden, what can I do to change these people, maybe the students or maybe the society at large? The scholarship have transformed my education by uh, the KCB, uh, actually provide us with the set books and also it also pay for me the school fees and Right now, like I'm in Form 3, the first time they bought me a new uniform. It has given me this motivation to work hard because I know there are people who are working not to feed their own family, not to feed, not to educate their own children, but to educate me. We are doing that to ensure that we give back to the communities, to ensure that we have future leaders and yourselves. This is an opportunity that you have, you and others have been given to actually better yourselves. It has taken me to a school where I have many ideas and I can, I can use them to innovate things. It has helped me to, to be in my dream school, my forces academy, and it has also helped me to acquire better education skills and better life skills. Now I'm enjoying my education and now I can't even be sent home for the school fees. Well, you have the solutions for the problems you're going to face. You want to do that, you have the solutions in your mind. We are here from uh, 15th to the 20th of August for the annual mentorship forum. The annual mentorship program is the climax in our mentorship calendar. It's a fantastic program and I think we've had amazing success with it. It's where we bring together all of our scholarship beneficiaries, past, present, for a number of days of mentorship where we do a host of activities both indoor and outdoor with the intention of inspiring uh, and triggering success as well as providing psychosocial support through various group engagements. What is actually inspiring me a lot is the fact that this forum 
has given our children who are under scholarship a very good exposure. They get to interact with students from other schools. They get to learn the ways of uh, the social life. As you start this week, let this be a moment that shapes you. For us as KCP Foundation, being a, you know, a, a, a social arm of the corporate, this is a lot of pride that we invest in the community. The mentorship is very, very nice because uh, it is actually uh, feeding me with knowledge about life and how I can be successful and a greater man in future. We get exposed to the challenges that each other face and how to overcome them. We are taught on how to cope with life situations and everything. We are taught on how to work hard on our dreams. We have learned about teamwork. Last year we learned about emotional intelligence. This time we have learned about being all-rounded and finishing strong. One of the key things that we learn is that to whom much is given, much is required. That when KCB gives you this scholarship, it expects nothing better than what you were in the first place. So I will sacrifice again for the good of the children and also the foundation to take the feedback from the students and also see what is happening. I'm also learning. My best moments here, it is, it is when I engage with those people who, who really encourage me on how I can go well with my life and how I can build up my life. Uh, my best moment is when we are in class and we are dancing. Yesterday, when Tumbili was presenting to us, it was fun, entertaining, and I laughed a lot. This is my first time to come. I've, I've really enjoyed it. I think we will have influence extending it to two weeks. In future, I would like to be a surgeon. I was once saved from the jaws of death by a surgeon. I would like to be a flying doctor. I want to be the best member surgeon in the world. I would like to be a civil engineer because those people are paid well and I would like also to help those, those people who are suffering the outside. Anybody can wake up today and practice and become the global idol. There is no magic, totally no magic. And many times our challenge is you're in the right bracket, right age, right connection. And this kind of mentorship will help you to speak to your friends, get knowledge, build on the black of others, build friends. Use them to become a better of what you can become. Please make sure you are tomorrow's Kenya. And if you don't make up your mind, you're going to be very difficult for us to really reach anywhere. I want to thank you, people sincerely, for thinking about this kind of direction. This is the way to go by investing in the youth. I really congratulate KCB Foundation, especially I'm happy on the disability program. In fact, very happy indeed. I'll take the message to our branch and also I want to be a, an ambassador to KCB on how people should treat the person living with a disability. Thank you so much. Me, what I'll do is just to work hard to achieve my goal, to get a good Mm, uh, good performance. To KCB Bank, I would like to first thank you for this opportunity that you have accorded me. I want to thank them from the deepest of my heart. So I just want to say thank you. They've given us so many opportunities that others can't access. Our friends at school have never accessed. Uh, one of them is like meeting with the prominent people that we met with the previous day, like Manu Chandaria and the CEO to the Google Foundation. It's just awesome. You have made it so much easier for us to acquire education. You have equipped us with uh, skills that will help us help others. You have opened doors which will have been impossible for our parents to open for us. You have made it easier for us to, to reach our dreams. All I can say is thank you and thank you.